beautiful Buenos Aires in Argentina. I've just stepped outside my hostel and the streets are absolutely packed with this gigantic protest. From what I've been told, they're protesting workers' salaries. They're demanding higher salaries for the workers. We're gonna walk around a little bit, hopefully ask some people what's going on and, uh, and try to see how far this stretches. This is absolutely massive. I've never seen anything like this before in my life.
fries, papas fritas, and a little bit of like a little uh, chorizo, it looks like, and maybe lomito. Argentina every day has just been incredibly overwhelming with uh, the kindness of the people, the deliciousness of the food, and now seeing the spirit of the local Argentinian people in the streets, fighting, shouting for what they want. A testament to the power of the human being. Burger, the 
right here. We've got a hamburger. We've got it looks like salsa papas. We gotta go find somewhere to eat this. Support the workers. This is incredible. What a what an absolutely mind blowing experience. Go see a protest. Go support locals and grab a bite to eat while you're doing it. I'm at a loss for I'm at a loss for words. Woo! Ah! All the sausages are falling. Take a look at this. Wow! 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 Hold on a second, guys. Hold on. Okay. Okay. We're gonna take a bite of the hamburguesa first. This looks amazing. We've got a tomato on there, some lettuce. It's a very, very thin patty, and this perfectly cooked egg on top. Ow! Oh my God! Wow! Very impressive for a street food burger. Oh my God! This is really, really good. What? Wow! Really, really great flavor. It needs a little ketchup, but wow, the flavor in the meat, really, really nice. The egg, cooked to perfection, very, very pure. Okay, uh, this total, this all together was about $3.50, I think. The two of these all together were just about $3. Incredible, incredible value. I literally thought I was only gonna take a couple bites of this, this is absolutely delicious. So good! Oh, okay, let's try some of the papas fritas. I'm definitely in desperate need of some ketchup though. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, they're good. Oh my god. They actually have some sort of seasoning on them. I can't describe what it is. I thought they just pulled them out of the oil. But this is not like a french fry you would get in fast food. It's got a very like hearty flavor to it. This is legit one of the best french fries I've ever had in Latin America, my god. Maybe food just tastes better when you're surrounded by energy and change and revolution, am I right? Oh, so good. My friend Lindsay is back at the hostel. I feel like I should bring her some food. I don't know, uh, I don't know if this burger's gonna make it though. so I can't eat much, but one more bite. Mm. Amazing. Okay, I'm gonna have one more of the salty papas, one more papas fritas. Sausage, it's it's a hot dog essentially, but it's like a cut up hot dog, I guess you could say. It tastes a lot better than a, a regular hot dog from the grocery store for sure. Unreal. I want to find someone that I can give these to. There's a lot of unhoused people around the central section here, um, and anytime I have food I can't finish, I always try to make sure that it doesn't go to waste and not to throw it out. I did throw the burger out because there's something kind of gross about giving somebody your half eaten burger, you dig? All right, let's go make our way back down this way. Oh, that was so good. That burger, whoo, it's got me hyped up, y'all.
my piece of food just about right I don't know how I was gonna get my hands around that. We're marching into direct sunlight, unfortunately.
talk about what's going on out here. Um, but I do realize that they may be a little apprehensive as well. There's also the language barrier. I'm not fluent in Espanol. Maybe we can find someone who speaks English. I only know that it's a protest um, for workers demanding higher salaries. Excuse me, the burger's backing up. Uh, because one of the hostile employees told me that's what was going on. A uh, quick side note. Buenos Aires is filled with so much incredible street art. Oh, okay. Maybe you relate to something going on that wall. That wall looks like a protest wall. It was very like anti-big corporation. It's calling like Shell Oil vultures and JP Morgan vultures, the financial companies. I don't know what the other, other companies up there listed are. And it's going. We're still going, baby. We're pushing on. Frutas. She's got some like frozen fruit. I've had enough food for now though. We're focused, we're focused on filming. My fingers are greasy enough. God. I, I want to go back for more of those fries. That was so good. A little bit of ketchup, maybe a little bit of hot sauce on the side. Whew. Hola amigo. Hey amigo. Oh, hola, hola. Glad I put on the sunscreen today because I'm getting zapped. By well, those UV rays of the sun right now. Hola! 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 almost feels like I'm at some sort of music festival with the energy out here. People just everywhere sprawled all over the streets. I'm really curious to know if this is a weekly thing. If you're watching, if you're from Argentina and you're in the comments, let me know. Please add some uh, color to what's going on here. We'd love to know more details. Is this a, a, a weekly event? Who knows? It, it, it certainly doesn't look like the first time these people have protested because they are ready. There's thousands of flags out here. I mean, look at them. So many flags. Hola. Uh, do you have do you have long legs? No. Oh, okay. Gracias, gracias. We're gonna keep pushing on straight towards the palace up here. Try to see what the end of this protest looks like, or the beginning, depending on how you look at it. I'm really confused now because we've got these people here that are like shutting down the street and then we had other people across the other streets marching but the marching group was a lot lot smaller got some more frozen frutas that guy's selling like some dried corn or something wow 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 that lady's brilliant she's got an umbrella I need that whoa okay this is like a fast food joint mostaza I think it might be their equivalent of like McDonald's, although it looks a little more like their equivalent of Burger King. Don't even know what that means. But yeesh, look at this line. Everyone is lining up to get fast food. No, 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 don't they know there's a delicious street food burger stall down the street? What are they doing? Somebody tell them. Somebody tell them, they don't know, they don't know. Wow. Woo. Get it absolutely cooked. I feel like I was dunked in that french fry oil as well. More frozen food, more frozen food. This is why you travel the world, to see things you've never seen before, to wind up in a country that you've never been to, to walk out your door and not know what to expect. That's the beauty of travel, baby. If you're still thinking about it, get out and do it. Just get out and do it. Take that chance, book that trip. Well, 
Buy that ticket. So many people out here. Okay, as you can see, coming up to the palace. This guy's selling some Coca-Cola on a bike. Wow, man. Oh, incredible. Looks like it's actually it's actually going further. I think it might actually butt up right to the gates of the palace. Hola. A lot of people watching. A lot of people just trying to get where they need to be. It looks like a bunch of buses have stopped here, so I wonder if uh, the protesters were bussed in. about to get run over by a, a motorcycle here we don't need that okay working our way towards the palace I'm hearing more drumming more energy this is absurd I kind of want to go back to the hostel and take my drone out because I've got a perfect overhead shot of everything that's going on here Wow more and more people I'm gonna try to stay in the shady areas. Oh wow, so many buses. Oh wow. Oh, it's it's heating up. It's 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 heating up over here. I can feel the energy. I can hear it getting louder. More percussion. More chanting. More singing. is a movement. Argentina is a country of 21 million people. I think a lot of those people are in the street right now. Whew. If you can't tell, it's beautiful, hot, and sunny today in Buenos Aires. I'm trying to keep my eye uh, to make sure I don't step, in, step on anybody. And no one bumps into me because it's starting to get more and more crowded on these side streets. People that look like they're just trying to get home from work. It's like nothing I've ever seen before. It feels like the Macy's Thanksgiving Day Parade or something. Absolute loss for words.
I don't have much to say. I'm just gonna let the the singing, the chant, and the people speak for themselves for a little bit. benches to sit on in the streets but most people are standing hola gracias wow we're out here it is a giant protest in buenos aires thousands thousands of people out here the crowds are starting to get more and more dense as we reach the capital right there. Sorry, not the capital, as we reach the palace. They said, but I think they were making fun of me. Hola! I could provide more context into what's going on. I'm going to uh, reach out to some of my friends that are local and get a better understanding of what's going on right now so I can uh, share it at the start of the video and uh, then include it in the description. Because uh, right now I'm just, just kind of at a loss. Hola, hola. Everybody's so nice. So, so nice. Hola. <laughs> Gotta make sure I'm smiling so people know that I'm not some sort of undercover resistance spy or something. I know uh, <laughs> in some places around the world there's surveillance and things like that. When you go in and protest, they, they take a picture of your face, they scan it, they upload it. Next thing you know, you're in some system, some database for the rest of your life. So I, I'd be freaked out too, maybe, if some guy was walking around with a camera. But hopefully I look harmless enough. Ooh, I don't know. I'm, I might have to grab an empanada now. All this, all this journalism, all this, all this energy out here got me hungry. Wow, it's still going. Let's get back out into the street. Oh my God, this might go for many more blocks. Actually, look at this. There's no end in sight, I can't tell. Never, never in my life have I seen anything like this. Where's that next hamburger stand though? That's what I'm ready for. Hello. She was walking along with some, hola. Hello. Hola, hola, gracias. I don't know how much further I can walk in the sun. It's it's directly in me. Okay, so I'm going to read this directly from my friend here in Buenos Aires. She's a local Argentinian. She's lived here her entire life. She said, these are left parties, most of them communistas. They don't agree with the payment of the big debt that we have with the International Monetary Fund, the IMF. 
debt that Mauricio Macri did and it is the biggest in the history of the world. So I'm, I, I, I don't know a lot about Argentina history, but from what uh, I gather from that message, the largest debt in the world is owned by Argentina to the IMF and people are upset about it. Probably rightfully so. Uh, but, but curious, com communistas, communists, I assume that means uh, everyone has a different definition of the word communist. We're not gonna waver in any political thoughts or beliefs right now. I'm just here to report, just the facts, baby, just facts. Wow. Absolute madness. Absolute madness. And it goes, and it goes, and it goes, and the flags. Flags for miles. Hola! It's almost too packed down the street for, for me to even walk on. The side streets too. I don't want to get in the way of anybody trying to get where they need to be, so let's go over here. ahead with this glare right now the sun is at its peak right now it's at its strongest in the day okay more people more signs more protest
incredible. I can't believe how many people are out here. I'm gonna get up to the end of the street and then I think it's time to turn around. I might be walking all day if I, if I try to get to the end of this thing. these people are going anywhere soon man they got they got the mate out they are comfortable wow this must have been planned for a very long time incredible coordination it looks like the police have blocked off some of the blocks as well so cars can't pass through I mean it, it just goes and goes and goes my drone won't even won't even go this far Okay, my friends, I have to get back to the hostel now, uh, unfortunately, but if, if anything uh, from what we've seen is, is accurate, this, this is going to continue for blocks and blocks and blocks. Really interested to see how late into the night this goes. Is this, a, is this an all-night thing? Is it, is it, who knows? Who knows? I've got a lot of questions, just as many as you do. I hope you enjoyed this very interesting slice of culture and politics here in Argentina. Again, never have I seen anything like this in my life. Thanks so much uh, for being a part of it. My name is Brent Tim, and I'm saying ciao for now. <laughs>